Welcome to RenewEnergy.com, your renewable energy and sustainability platform. At RenewEnergy.com, we believe in the power of clean, sustainable energy to transform the way we live and work. That's why we offer a range of solutions for businesses and homeowners looking to switch to renewable energy sources such as solar, wind, and water. Hydrogen, the most abundant element in the universe, presents an exciting opportunity for sustainable energy production. The critical aspect to ensure its sustainability is the green production of hydrogen, referring to methods that use renewable or non-fossil energy sources and result in zero or minimal greenhouse gas emissions. The most widely recognized green hydrogen production method is water electrolysis. This process involves passing an electric current through water to separate it into hydrogen and oxygen. The electricity can be sourced from renewables like solar or wind. There are three main types of electrolysis. Proton exchange membrane, PEM, electrolysis uses a solid polymer as an electrolyte and protons, H+, as conducting ions. It's ideal for intermittent and high-pressure operation. Alkaline electrolysis uses an alkaline solution as an electrolyte. This method is efficient but slower in response time to power supply variations. Solid oxide electrolysis cell, SOEC, operates at high temperatures, 800 to 1000 degrees Celsius, utilizing heat energy to produce hydrogen, thus achieving high efficiency. Another green method is photocatalytic water splitting. Like a process mimicking photosynthesis, this method uses sunlight to split water into hydrogen and oxygen. Various photocatalysts, such as titanium dioxide, TO2, are used. The efficiency and scalability of this process are areas of ongoing research. Biological methods also offer an interesting approach to green hydrogen production. Microbes or algae can be employed in this process. In photofermentation, specific types of bacteria convert organic substances into hydrogen in the presence of light. Dark fermentation uses certain bacteria to produce hydrogen from organic matter even without light. Biophotolysis is another method where algae use sunlight to split water and produce hydrogen. There are also thermochemical methods that involve high temperature chemical reactions. For instance, the sulfur iodine process uses cycles of evaporation, condensation, and electrochemical action to produce hydrogen. Lastly, gasification is a process that converts organic materials like biomass into hydrogen and carbon dioxide. The biomass is heated in the presence of oxygen or steam to produce syngas, synthetic gas, which is then processed to extract hydrogen. While each of these methods has its strengths and challenges, water electrolysis powered by renewable energy is currently the most promising for large-scale green hydrogen production. However, the rapid pace of research in this area might soon lead to other methods becoming more viable, moving us towards a more sustainable energy future. Thank you for choosing RenewEnergy.com as your go-to source for all things renewable energy and sustainability. With our YouTube channel, we explore the latest developments and innovations in the field, including hydrogen fuel cells and the use of AI and machine learning to optimize energy consumption. If you're ready to take the next step towards a cleaner, more sustainable future, visit us at RenewEnergy.com and discover the many ways we can help you transition to renewable energy. Thank you for watching and subscribing. Stay up to date on all the latest news and insights by subscribing today.